Top Gear's Patty McGuinness fine after Lamborghini skid. Top Gear presenter Patty McGuinness has said he is totally fine after skidding a supercar off the road while filming in North Yorkshire. The TV star wrote on Instagram he had had a bit of a prank but insisted things were all nice and bonny. In a video, he said it had been a mad old day and he would be having a paracetamol and a little cry. A Top Gear spokesman said McGuinness was unhurt in Tuesday's incident and that no other vehicles were involved. Safety on Top Gear is always the production team's priority and the vehicle's speed at the time was within the road's limit of 60 miles per hour, he added. McGuinness was driving a Lamborghini Diablo, which he described as one of his fantasy childhood cars. Made between 1990 and 2001, it was the Italian manufacturer's first model to reach speeds of over 200 miles per hour. But the presenter said they don't like torrential rain. On Wednesday, he posted another video showing damage to the rear of the car. It wasn't as bad as it was made out yesterday to be honest, he said. But it just shows you, a little bit of oil on a wet road, lethal. The bright red car had been pictured covered in a tarpaulin following the incident on the B6255 near Ribblehead. The former Take Me Out host became a presenter on the BBC2 motoring show last year alongside Chris Harris and Andrew Freddie Flintoff. Last year, Flintoff veered off the Top Gear track near York while driving a three-wheel vehicle at high speed. Another 2019 incident saw the same presenter drive into a market stall while filming in Mansfield. In 2006, former Top Gear host Richard Hammond was involved in a near-fatal accident when he crashed at 288 miles per hour. The presenter suffered severe head injuries and was put in an induced coma after his rocket-powered dragster spun out of control.